Hi, I'm Robert from tmile.com and this video is about how to install and set up your Xilech WordPress theme. Once the files are downloaded, log into your WordPress dashboard, head to Appearance, Themes, then click to Add New. Upload theme and choose the archive file. Click Install now and wait until the installation process is complete. Live preview the theme, then hit the button Save and Activate. The recommended plugins for this theme are Jetpack and Pirate Forms. My recommendation is to install and activate the Jetpack plugin, then connect it to your WordPress.com account in order to use it. This plugin has a lot of useful options and one is a very nice related posts element in your customizable sections. You'll see more about this at the end of this video. After you finish with Jetpack, install and activate the Pirate Forms plugin, then head to Settings, Pirate Forms. Copy the shortcode and paste it into your contact page. After all these additional settings are done, move to the theme settings. Let's start customizing it with the first section named Site Identity. Here you can change the site title, tagline, upload a custom logo with transparent background and tick the option to hide the site title when a logo is on. The site icon option comes last. Now hit save and publish and move to the next step. First theme option can be set as alternative layout. This way your block structure will be displayed as masonry type. Furthermore, you can tick the show sidebar option. Show tags and get the first image in the post as featured. If no image is set as featured one, when you publish a new post. Select the font family for content and headings, then set the font size as you wish to be. Save and publish, then go back to the featured content slider. You are able to choose the slider category here just if you published more than two blog posts in that particular one. And most importantly, the posts need to have featured images on. Keep in mind that only other categories than the chosen one for the slider will be gathered below as latest posts. Now go to colors where default scheme can be changed using this drop down menu. Set the header text color to your preferred one and leave the background color to white just if you have no other preferences. Hit save and publish from time to time or at the end if you are not afraid to lose any changes already done. The header image is what you see underneath the logo and tagline. Upload any image here that fits perfectly in or leave the header as simply as a clear white. Now go to the background settings and play around with some good images to see if you like how it looks. I leave this setting without any image for now. Many settings are the next thing to do. Please watch another video created here, especially for this purpose, where you can see how I set everything up, including the beautiful icons for every item. If you opted for the sidebar to be displayed, access the widgets section and set up the widgets both for sidebar and footer area. Choose the content for them according with your preferences. The static front page need to be set as your latest posts in order to function as in the demo. Feel free to create a custom page for the front page and set it here to be the default one. If you know how to play around with the CSS settings, access the special section for this action and do your best. Now we are at the last section named related posts as I mentioned. This section is powered by Jetpack and looks very nice when it's on. You are able to set a custom headline for this section. Pick an option you might love to be on, arrange the layout as a list or grid, the grid is the best one. And you are done. Your Xilech WordPress theme is installed and ready for new content. Thanks for watching. Please check out our latest tutorials about WordPress plugins, themes and much more. Please share them if you like what you see, hit the like button and ask any question through the comment section below. Help us inform you about new uploads by hitting the subscribe button right here.